So just finished rendering my video for the third time, the exact same one in Camtasia 2019. And the last two times there have been random black blackouts in my footage. And I have no idea why. So I'm pretty frustrated. So this is my third time. I'm finished rendering it. Looks good so far. Again, you can see that this is now a black screen. You hear me talking, but there's no footage in here. And I have no idea why. So I'm gonna have to try and figure it out, but this is pretty frustrating. Here's another project I was working on, and I realized during the playback, some of the footage wasn't showing, but the footage was in the timeline. So I put a side-by-side -side comparison here. On the left, the footage is gone, and on the right, the footage is there. Again, the exact same video, the exact same timeline. And it was starting to get frustrating why some pieces were showing and some footage wasn't showing during the playback. So after some deep Googling, I figured out what the reason was and it had to do with having a GPU accelerated process. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you how to fix it. So to edit, preferences, hit the advanced tab, as you can see, I have hardware acceleration turned on using my uh, RTX 2080 Super. I have to turn that off to use software mode only. Click OK. I have to save my project, exit, and reload the project for the settings to occur. So now we're going to open up Camtasia 2019 and then reload the project I was working on. So with the hardware acceleration turned off, now it's strictly just using my processor, which is AMD Ryzen 3700. So that means when I'm rendering, instead of using the GPU and combined CPU, it's now all strictly just CPU. So now I just wanted to benchmark what the speed would be using hardware acceleration and just using the CPU only and see what the difference was. So here I am rendering the exact same videos using the two different processes. So on the left hand side, you can see the GPU is being used about between 25 and 30% for processing and rendering. And on the right hand side, you can see it is just strictly just using the CPU only to render the, the video. Again, this is a 4K timeline. I'm just gonna let it play out here and, and see what the timestamp is. So you can see that the GPU acceleration with the RTX 2080 Super completed the rendering in nine minutes and 38 seconds and the CPU only is still continuing, and it completed rendering in 10 minutes and 45 seconds. So it's a difference of one minute and seven seconds. So to fix the rendering video, all you have to do is turn off the GPU acceleration. I'm just gonna leave the steps here. You can just pause the video to review how you to do it. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to my channel for future content. Thank you for watching, and until next time.